is a prophetic word for you today. Because God loves you. If not, you will hear this message. Adjust yourself. Stop running around, opening your legs easily to make. It cannot make you any good. It will make you to be very, very cheap. When you are cheap in the market, everybody buys you. Make yourself expensive and you get married. Make yourself expensive, don't be too cheap. Laugh, be friendly, be jovial, but don't be stupid. Don't be a fool. Don't allow anybody to fool you. Hiya! Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. It's a Valentine's Day. It's a Valentine's Day. It's a Valentine's Day. It's a Valentine's Day. service, I will go and first of all, get a good Valentine gift for my pastor. And your boyfriends. Because now me be general boyfriend. Okay, sir. Amen. 
there on the road too. Now maybe the father way they see here now. Until you go home, you begin to see your parents. Amen? Amen. Tomorrow is that day. And I suppose you know already that you shouldn't be fooled by anyone. You shouldn't allow anyone to mess you up. Right on, sir. Amen. Amen sir. You should extend the love to your parents, to your siblings, to people out there in a wise momentum. Amen. It's not what they think about it. I will teach on that and they dish it out on our YouTube channel for you to know more. I will talk, teach deep about Valentine. You watch it there. Amen? Amen. So that you'll be more guided very well. Amen. Amen. I pray for you, you that are standing here. By the power of God, because you are a carrier of many nations. Yes. You are the container of many deposits and many talents. Therefore, I speak upon you all that are standing here. May God make a way for you. May God see you through. May God open channels of favor in your life. And may God open your eyes to see what you need to do at every given time. In the name of Jesus, I pray. It is settled. Go and come back with this money in Jesus' name. Rejoice and go back. Thank you, Lord. Celebrate, celebrate. Amen. Amen. Please, I want to pray for one set of people and I conclude. Amen. Amen. Please, if you are only son, only son, only child, or only son with female siblings. Amen. Eventually, you are only daughter, only but one daughter, or a daughter with male siblings. Please come out. I want to pray that God will give you loved ones. It's a very important prayer. God will take away betrayal far from you. You know why? You need someone to love you. Yes. And I want to tell you that I love you. Amen. Let me tell you something, church. <laughs> you may not understand, but I don't want you people to be emotional. For what I want to say. Never you. It's just a reference. Amen. Amen. Do you know what it means? You build a house. You bought a car. And no closer person to enjoy it with. You don't understand it. You think it's an easy something. <laughs> they need people. Amen? As a man among them need it. Not just a wife. Look at it. Men among them now, they don't just need a wife. They need a wife. A sister. As in one person in dimensional, that one will be a wife, will be a sister. It will be a little lord, it will be a friend, it will be many things. And then, not just giving a bed, harvest children. Did you understand the point? It's not about to give a hey, first I want to give two children. If I pray for you people now, it's not about giving it, you know how pig, pig used to deliver. I'm telling you. If your faith doesn't carry the prayer, you tell me, you go by the side. But if you have the faith, after praying it, it may start happening anyhow. Yes. Well, you care. So that you need to be careful after the prayer. Amen. Amen. Uh -huh. You need to be careful because it will move, it will metamorphose in the realm of spirit. Let me tell you, church. The particular day God told Abraham, I will bless you and make your seed a blessing. You and I, we are in his loins. Go and check the Bible. So you don't know. So you yourself doesn't even know that as you are seated now, as you are now, there's the voices I'm hearing from your loins. 
Some of you who are single and hearing a voice say, Dad, you too fast, we want to come out. You don't know? No, very soon you understand what I'm saying. I'm telling you, do fast, we want to come out. Some of you who have money and spend it anyhow, the voice has said, Dad, why are you spending this money like this? Don't you know that we are going to go to school? I want to pray for you people. I want to pray for you people. My prayer, amen. amen. If I were you, even when I mention something that is funny, you laugh and control it in the spirit. That is not matter. No, so you are not in the prison. At least you laugh, you compose yourself. Amen? I want to pray for you people. First prayer point I want to pray is massive child delivery. I know the importance. I know where I'm coming from. So I know the importance of the prayer. They need it. They don't need one or two children. No, 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 no. The enemy may invent them anyhow. The enemy may invent their house anyhow. They need multiple, they need quantum of children. They need no less than six, seven children each. At least. That they didn't have children, six to seven children. And for some people who have the strength and the vigor and the right radicality as my own, they will have nine. Don't even shake. It can come in two, two ways. I speak, therefore, upon you all that are here. I am commanding that from now, the zeal and the passion to fulfill this word will come upon you. The zeal to do it, nobody, no man, no woman will push you on your own. The zeal will come. The power, the strength to fulfill this word will come upon you from now. Let it come upon you from now. Let it come upon you from now. Let it come upon you from now. Your genealogy will not shut down. Your people, your descendants, wherever they are, they will begin to see that you are doing marvelously. I decree that your ancestral line, no matter what, whether they are few in number, you can never be few in number. Amen. The Bible said that street where there are very few, Go there again, there will be many people over there. It's a prophetic word. I prophesy upon you, receive massive delivery. Amen. Massive delivery. Amen. Massive delivery. Amen. Twins, 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 twins. Amen. Receive massive delivery. Amen. Twins, twins, twins. Amen. Receive massive delivery. 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 Twins, twins, twins. Amen. From now, it is purely set in the realm of the spirit. Amen. Amen. Be, 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 from now, when you are going on, whatever you are doing, keep on telling yourself that any moment from now, once you are settling down with whoever it may concern, children will be coming, there will be no delay. Amen. I pray for grace, for God to give you loved ones. People that will love you, not people that will betray you. Amen. People that will love you, people that will love you. Receive it in the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. You can go back now. Amen. 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 Last nobody list, please. All the workers come before the altar. All the workers step in. You guys might not know what impact you are creating. Amen. You might not know, but I'm here to tell you some of you that are not serious. Some of you who are not serious, I'm yet to lecture you people for you to understand what you are occupying, the position you are occupying, and what you are doing. Amen. 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 No. Amen. Yes. You might not understand why you are doing this or you are part of this movement. At a joy, join them. You might not know why that God in his own way put you through to stand by me at this time. 
Yes, a tree cannot make a forest. First of all, I appreciate all your effort. And I also encourage you to put more effort. Yes. If there is still you need to tell me, and you are saying, if I tell him, I don't know how you react, then you are not a good follower. Tell me that and allow me to react like whatever. Amen. Amen. Be open and tell me that thing. Amen. Amen. Even if I disagree, at the end of the day, that thing might work out something good. Tell me that thing. Praise the Lord. Whatever observation, tell me. Likewise, I'm throwing it to the members. If any of the observation, let it know to me and we put it, we fix it. Amen. Amen. That is one family. I want to pray for you. He that labor in the vineyard of God, may God labor his vineyard. I speak upon your life that whatever it be your heart desire in this year beyond, I am commanding that God will open doors and make it real in your life. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. I decree and I declare that this nation will not swallow you. I decree that as you are living here in peace, you shall go back in peace. In Jesus' name we pray. Go and come back with testimony. It is settled. We pray and I speak upon our brother. Them that always come from afar to worship with us. I pray upon you that are here today. You normally drive hour plus to be here. I want to tell you that your coming here will never be in vain. Because you are not coming here to see pastor, you are not coming here to look around. In fact, there's a lot of sightseeing where you can go and walk around. You have a better AC back home, but you are here just to maintain the gathering of people of God. Therefore, I speak that if I be a man of God, which I know truly I am, not by guessing, I am prophesying upon you people that whatever be your desire of coming this far to worship here, even though there's a lot of churches everywhere, every nook, nooks and cranny, you prefer coming down here to join us and serve God. I speak therefore, you will have nothing to regret. Amen. You will have nothing to regret. Amen. The third time, you will have nothing to regret. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. Then I want to stretch what your hand upon the man of God. I begin to prophesy upon, upon his life. Ask God to refuse him. Pray his family, his children, his wife. Pray that God will meet them at the point of their knees. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Pray now. God, we thank you for our person, Lord Jesus Christ. We bless your name upon his life. Lord, refuse him. The anointing. Let the Holy Spirit guide them and guide his family. Lord, bless his life and be prison in the more. Be in all shadows. Lord, we pray that may you bless them and bless them mightily. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. If you know you are here with your tithe, this is the time for, for our tithe. If you are here with your tithe, please come out and God of God pray for you. Come out to drop your tithe. Step forward to the altar. If you have your tithe, come before the altar. Come before the altar. Your tithe, you know, when they say tithe, some people are confused. Some people don't know where to start. When God blesses you, one, listen, believe in tithe. I must tell you, if you started with us in this church, ever when we started from Fema College, now I have not taken time to talk about that, to teach about that. That's the time for everything. Amen. Amen. I'm always busy bombing prayers, bombing prayers, so that that will saturate everywhere. 
Your tithing is one third out of what God has given you. Bring that one. Amen. One tenth. If God gives you one thousand, your tithe is hundred pesos. If God gives you one thousand, your tithe is hundred pesos. Amen. Amen. If we give you ten thousand, your tithe is one thousand pesos. If it gives you twenty thousand, your tithe is what? Two thousand. Huh? If God gives you five hundred thousand, your tithe is how much? Fifty thousand. Two hundred million. God should give you 200 million. Your tithe is how much? 20 million. Amen. Amen. Last year, when we are doing service of three days dry fasting, many people promised God, God, if you can bless me with 10 million, I'll give my tithe of 1 million. Most of them does not know that I know that God did it. God is blessing people here, let me tell you. Not by bragging. Amen. Amen. <laughs> eh? They know, but they don't have the mind to bring it out and give. Someone, 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 somehow here in this church approached me, said that there's something he promised God to do, went back home, a big task. It was here that God keep on disturbing him and disturbing him. He did it. And after doing it since then, God has not left him behind. It's hard to pay a dangerous sacrifice. But when you do it, God will embarrass you. He will surprise you, sorry, not embarrass you, he will surprise you. Amen? Amen. But the problem is that, are you a titan? Do you believe in titan? <laughs> Somebody was telling me the other time, that you don't know how to calculate it. Huh? Eh? Well, you know how to calculate your... <laughs> now you say so. <laughs> now you say <submit>. eh? so. <laughs> you don't know how to calculate it. When the money comes, you don't know how to calculate it. That is why I'm... But you know how to subtract it from your colleagues. <laughs> eh? yeah. Yeah, no. You don't know how to calculate it. <laughs> Should we agree? <laughs> I can let it in here and bring it now. I call the care, you can let it for you. I call me, I have my calculator. I can help you. Amen. So, not the waste of time. This is very important for us to clear it so that it can help you. I want to encourage you to believe in Titan. Believe in Titan is very, very important. Believe in Titan. Believe in seed. Titan works. Though I know, as I said, I will teach about Titan is something that will preserve your wealth. It's not as if you are not doing it, God will not bless. God will bless you, but that wealth is at stake. No security. That's why some of our people, after living here, gallivanting and rolling around and buying many things and uh, trying to go home and enjoy themselves, once they enter Nigeria, bam! They can be the Okay, we don't even every church until I'm not trying to tie it in. You think you are joking with God? No, sir. I'm not going to try to handle it until it is no more, and then they will pay more with thanks, sir. They will give out more with thanks, sir. God knows how he deal with people, we don't know. So believe in it, it is real. Some say they don't believe in it. Believe in it, though, there is a command that can preserve your wealth. That can increase your wealth. They believe in seed, in seed sowing. It's a different type of diet. Sow a seed. That one is something you are giving up and you are expecting something to come back because seed will germinate. Sow a seed. On behalf of the children that have not given birth to, I'm sowing this seed for my first son. You sow it. You are trying to make sure that that son will never suffer in his life. You know, I have not thought of anything, and we're just bumping prayer out to and we are going to be bumping it to until Easter before we move into any teaching. Amen. Amen. <laughs> so, believe in Titan, 
believe in seed. Believe in arms giving, the street beggars. Believe in motherless. Some people say only motherless they believe. Any other thing you are talking? You are talking nonsense. A wrong ideology. I pray for you, and God blesses you. You go to motherless. And my cheeks keep on going inside. You come to mother, I keep on praying again. After praying, you next month you go to motherless. And I'm eating bread and water. And you agree bringing the substance to motherless. And God is up there watching you. Uh -huh. Amen? Amen. It's very, very important I clear this step to help you. Amen? Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. May God bless you and bless your finances. Amen. I pray for you that are standing here. May God enrich your pocket, your financial wealth. May God open river. When I mean river, rivers of wealth upon you. Oceanic wealth. I demand a rain of blessing upon your lives. That as you are giving out, casting out your tithe, you are casting out everything that may stand against you. As I decree, so shall it be in Jesus' name. You can cast your tithe. Now this is our time for offering. I want you to dip your hand in your pocket and bring something thank you for the Lord. And where's your, your, your offering? You're going to your offering. You're going to speak a word. You need to speak a word in that morning. Ask God to, to bless you more. As you are dropping your offering today, speak a word upon that offering. Ask God to increase you in every ramification. I should meet you at the end of your day. Speak a word. It's very important. Lord, we thank you, Jesus Christ, upon our offering. Father, as your children will be giving their offering this morning, Lord, we pray that may you all increase them. Bless the work of their hand in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty precious name, we pray. Amen. Why are we not? Hallelujah. Amen. Deep, deep inside your pocket, I'm praying. Thank you, Brother. Jesus, you need to do. Oh, 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 oh